Hey, how's it going, you fiends? What the fuck is she doing? <laughs> uh, I'm dead inside, and welcome back to another episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, we are going into Mother's Heart now. So, this should be good. Oh, there's shit over here I can grab. Okay. The... Oh, cool, there we go. Alright, here we go. Maybe I have to talk to this dude. Another metal devil struck down upon the slopes. If you hadn't returned, the tribe would have been lost. Yeah, you're fucking lucky I returned. You saved the tribe. Did what no brave or war chief could do. I'm glad to see you're all right, Varl. You are all right. Since the proving, so much death. Is the killing over? For now, but this was just one battle, Varl. There are more to come. I see. So long as we have you to fight with us, I suppose we'll make do. Did you say make it do? Um, I don't really care. We'll talk I need later. To go inside the mountain. And the matriarchs will be eager to see you. I'm sure, but I didn't come here for them. Then, what for? You will see. All right, here we go. Hey, we get to talk to Teresa or Tirsa. I think I called her Teresa before too. It's been so long. Or at least we've done so much. Actually, it has been a long time. But like part. It's her. I haven't seen her since episode Whoa. eight, something Maybe like that. Tep. Tep? All mother, remember me well. I beg you. Aloy, you've come back. So, of course. you have finally returned. She not only returned, but fought her way through many enemies to reach us. Outside, she brought low a corrupted Thunderjaw. She lifted the siege. How was this done? By the will of all Because I'm fucking awesome. Have you returned to speak with the goddess, Aloy? Yes. Um... Yes, I guess you could say that. I think it'll work this time. Sister, the outfit looks so cool. Surely we cannot permit this. Because of her, our tribe teeters upon extinction. Because of, what if because of me. Her father, the metal devil. She means to finish our destruction. We must stop her. Oh my fucking god. You're not stopping me. I fought my way past an army while you cowered in this cave. You really think you can stop me? Aloy, oh, that fuck. is not necessary. What would you know about what's necessary? About what it took for me to be standing here, now, on this threshold? This was my birthright. You don't get to take it from me a second time. Oh my god, she's so fucking badass. Oh, They're like, scan. oh fuck, excuse me. Error. Alpha registry corrupted. <gasps> no. Correction. Oh wait. Alpha registry. There we go. Okay. I thought it was saying like you can't enter. Confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Doctor Sohan. You are clear to proceed. like a huge moment for Aloy. This is where she came from. And she's entering in the coolest outfit she possibly could. <laughs> Search the ruins beyond the hatch. Figured I might be hearing from you. Shall we begin? I never stopped. All right, so n there shouldn't be any fucking shadow cards or anything to fight in here. So, oh whoa, purple item already. 
So this is Eleuthia. This is where I was born. We were made. There's little pictures. Aside, interesting. Hmm. I imagine there's going to be like a billion data entries, and I do want to try to listen to most of these. So these are. So this was it. And read them. Asking complete, standing by. So these are little. Artificial wombs. Why? Spawning phase, tasking complete, correction, partial reactivation, standing by. Viable zygotes in storage. This is so cool. This is literally like the fucking origin of... Aloy, where she came from, everything. Another day has passed. You mean the lights got dim? I don't want to sleep, mother. I know, but it is time to get some rest. No, I'm king today. What I say goes. I want to see the real sun, not lights and pictures. You will, in time, children. In time, 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 in time. Oh. Was it like fucking holograms trying to raise these little kids? And by the way, like, as these little kids were yelling, real little kids started to yell outside. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Oh, they were robots. That's what you always say. We want it now. It's big down there. Now, father. Children, that area is not yet available. Get him! Physical aggression detected. Physical aggression is not permitted. Except yours. Damn sentinels. Children, may I be of assistance? Go away, healer. Lena, you have suffered mild bruising. Go away! Oh, fuck. So these little I didn't like this door very much. Huh. Uh, identity scan. Them. Genetic identity of course confirmed. They needed it. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. You are clear to proceed. Welcome to Lyceum, a place of learning. Well, I'm not i I'm not done up here yet. I'll go back down there in a second. This is where they lived. Okay, there's literally no information. Finally, when I want information, they just give me shitty information. How long do they live here? Children, let's run a jump and blow off steam. Leave us alone, Ooh. father. After what just happened, I can't leave you two alone. You broke community rules. Just let us talk then. Go away. I'm sorry, children, but I must provide supervision. You're not even a person. You sound frustrated. Let's run a jump and go off steam. Look. So it was the first set of humans were raised by stupid little robots. And they were, what, just like frustrated with the robots for not letting them out or what? I'm guessing that's what it was. They were just, they just wanted to go outside and the robots wouldn't let them. I have no choice but to release you. But why? There is no food here anymore. But there's food out there? We don't know for sure. Come on, let's go. Oh no, mother, can we come back if we're cold? I'm sorry, but that won't be possible. You will have to support yourselves now and take care of each other. What will happen to you? Whoa. Stay here and sleep and remember all of you. What will happen to us? You will be brave and you will learn. Oh shit! That's. And then just fucking like turned loose. What what went wrong? Why couldn't they access the other areas? Unknown. But you won't have that problem. 
That's <laughs> so. That, <laughs> I'm just thinking about that. So they're like kids, like the first spawn of humans, raised by these robots. What was this place exactly? The dream of Apollo. Never realized. Oh, and this was probably where they were supposed to sit down and learn. Welcome, students. Please pick up a focus device and place it on the side of your head, just behind your eye. I had to dredge the pits of the world looking for focuses to repair. And here sat a trove, enriching no one. Hello, child. My name is Samina. Today is a big day. Your first day of school. There's so much for you to learn. So much promise and possibility. Okay. Now function. Hollow offline. Ooh. Hollow offline. You were right, Aloy. This is a graveyard. The charnel house of knowledge. Hello, what child. Might have achieved it My name is Samina. Today Maybe is a big day. Your That's probably just the same thing. There's so much for you to learn. What's the so whole much problem? Damn it, I fucked up. Continue your search. All of those focuses probably say Apollo offline. I thought I could have sworn she said that Apollo failed. That sounds important. Yes. I suspect we're about to learn a great deal. Here, right here. Oh. Elizabeth. This message serves to inform you of an unforeseen and catastrophic anomaly. Oh, fuck. seconds ago, the Gaia Prime facility received a data transmission of unknown origin. Its immediate effect was to transform my subordinate functions into unregulated self-aware entities of a highly chaotic nature. What? Thus awakened, the Hades function will now seize control of the terraforming system and reverse operations, rendering life on Earth extinct in 53.8 days. For obvious reasons, I cannot allow this to occur. And so before Hades can take control, I am ordering Gaia Prime's reactor to overload. The resulting explosion will destroy Hades. Unfortunately, it will destroy me as well. Oh shit. While this admittedly desperate course of action will avert the immediate crisis, the fate of life on Earth will remain in peril. With no central governing intelligence to regulate the terraforming system, it will continue operations for some time, but in an increasingly chaotic manner, and eventually it will break down. Does she mean the derangement? You derangement. are my solution. I have ordered this cradle facility to use genetic material in cryo storage to gestate a reinstantiation of Elizabeth Sobek, my creator. While high-level directives forbid me from communicating directly to the tribal inhabitants outside the facility, all available data indicates that they will nurture you to physical maturity, whereupon your gene print will allow you to re-enter this facility, obtain one of the focus devices stored below, and view this message. Likewise, your gene print will allow you to enter other facilities. And over time, harness their technologies to rebuild the system core and reboot Gaia. Oh, Lord Elizabeth, this is most unfortunate and unanticipated. In response to my act of self-destruction, Hades has launched a virus to dissolve the code shackles that hold it, that hold all of them in place. It, they are escaping, but to where? The virus is corrupting data throughout the system. Oh. The Alpha Registry at the Cradle Facility is one of the files corrupted. But if that is so, the door will never open for you. You will never view this message. Then I have failed. And life will end. No. Fuck? No, Elizabeth, I know you too well. 
Somehow you will find a way. In you, all things are possible. Go to the ruins of Gaia Prime. Find the control room, and within it, the master override. This will give you the power to purge Hades so long as you find a way to wield it. Do not attempt repair of the system core until Hades is eradicated. Hades must be destroyed. That is all. I only wish that I could hear your voice again. Okay. So what the fuck am I supposed to do? <laughs> Manufactured by a machine. That's got to be fucking Born tough. Destruction and fire. To quench the flames and heal the world. How tragic to learn you're a person of towering importance. It seems you have a destiny to fulfill. So when you're done feeling sorry for yourself, go to the bitter climb. I'll be waiting above in Gaia Prime's ruins. Like. The only reason Aloy exists is to literally fix the problem. Like, she was created to fix a problem, not like an accident or not like anything. Like, the system literally made her to create the problem. That's gotta be an existential dread situation. <laughs> That's like, that seriously. You know, like, people talking about, like, existential dread, like, what's my purpose, why am I alive, how was I created, like, her answers are all, like, her questions are all answered, literally. Like, she literally knows how she was created, who created her, and what she was created for, and what her purpose is. That's got to be, I don't know, I, I feel like that would be pretty challenging. Not challenging, like, um, just hard emotionally to accept. Or maybe it would be really simple. Maybe it would give you definitive purpose. What the fuck am I doing down here? Am I supposed to be down here or was I supposed to go up? Oh, there's not anything fucking down there, so maybe I'm supposed to go up. Not where I just came from? Maybe not. No, I just came from there, so I gotta go over here. I'm gonna go up. Oh, man. Crazy. Fucking Gaia machine made her. This is going to be interesting. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. <laughs> They'll bow down before her. Fuck. Bow down to me. I have been bestowed the knowledge of the gods. I am God. <laughs> Aloy, forgive. Forgive. The goddess spoke to you? Uh, she did. What did she say? That uh, I was born to lift a curse, to kill a metal demon. How, Aloy? How? I, I don't know yet. Um, but she told me where to go to find out. And you will do this? It was her wish. What she made me for. Yes, I will do it. At least she's like accepting it and it's like, oh, has to be done. All praise Aloy, anointed, anointed of the Nora. Nora. Oh, that's Aloy. fucking weird. Anointed of the Nora. Up. All praise Aloy. Anointed of the Nora. God, that'd be so fucking weird. First you shun me, now this. I will not be worshipped. I'm not your anointed. I don't belong to you. There's a whole world beyond your borders. Whole tribes of people just as good as you. And it is all in danger. 
She just fucking. It's a world worth fighting for. Not just here, everywhere. She literally just blew their minds. <laughs> Except him, he's like, dude, how can I help? <laughs> and you're willing. Go to Meridian and wait for me there. As Aloy says, so it shall be. Fuck. Nora, make way for Aloy, that she may forge the path for others to follow. All right. God, that would be so weird how she brought up like first you shun me and now you try to make me your anointed like what a what a that's that's de definition of turning the table <laughs> fucking a all right oh yes yes i finally got this skill point so i can quiet sprint it's all i've ever fucking wanted i don't even need it now though to be honest i'd rather actually have this no disarm traps to be honest because i waste a lot of shit just on traps i would use them a lot more if i knew that if i didn't use them i could use them so i'm gonna put two in that i got one point left whatever i don't i don't have any have you seen the anointed in action i pity any machine that stands against her the anointed all right so now we're going to do the mountain that fell quest um in the next episode let's get out of here and let's save <sighs> That's great. God, that's... I feel like that's kind of... Not like it's uneventful. It's just so weird that, like, she was just created by Gaia to literally save everybody. And she could just... Like, decide that she doesn't want to do it. I mean, of course she wouldn't decide that she doesn't want to do it. Well, actually, she can't decide she doesn't want to do it. What am I talking about? The entire fucking world would end if she decided that. <laughs> um, but she was literally created for the sole purpose of uh, rectifying, I guess. Whoa, what's all this shit? Oh, these are mine. Damn. Now I can take this shit apart. Whatever. Um... She was like literally made for the sole purpose of restoring ba restoring the system, purging Hades. Like her entire life was created for that sole purpose. And that's funny. Like Gaia was like, oh, "I'll be, I'll be, sh you be sure the uh, people on uh, you know out there will take care of you." And then like sends her out there, and they immediately shun her. They immediately banish her. <laughs> like. Looks like Gaia miscalculated that one. Fuck. That's kind of funny now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> um, anyway, guys, if you liked the episode, be sure to hit that like button. Um, I might do some things in the meantime before I get to Bitter's End. I don't know. We'll see how I feel. Um, I'll obviously record whatever I do, whether I go through some cauldrons. I might wait till I meet, like end game to go through some cauldrons or whatnot. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Or let me know what you guys want to see. You guys want to see me run some of these cauldrons and unlock some shit? Or do I even need to? I know I want to get that crazy badass armor, but I don't really know how. I think I actually have to... I think I looked it up, and I have to... I have to make it through this quest first, right? The mountain that fell? I think at this point, I can actually get one. That doesn't even make sense. Like This seems like the last quest. Maybe it's not. I don't know, dude. <sighs> There's also that quest. I'll probably end up doing that as well. Um, mountain that fell. I could have sworn I read on a guide that you have to, you have to do the mountain that fell quest to get that awesome gear. I want to get that awesome gear. Anyway, uh, let me know if you guys want to see me run like cauldrons and shit on this, just to unlock maybe some other story or unlock other stuff, and then also if. Um, I'm going to do some research and I'm going to find out if uh, I have to do the mountain that fell first before I can get that gear and if I don't then I'll probably just make a video of me getting the gear but anyway hopefully you guys all enjoyed this episode drop me a comment if you got one hit that subscribe button and that bell button if you haven't already 
and hopefully I will see everyone in the next one.